with contact cement on both surfaces, both the wood as well as the formica, uh, I usually do the wood twice. So I start with the wood, then the formica, and then at least a touch up, but oftentimes the second time on the wood because it just sucks into the wood itself. makes it a little bit easier to apply. Okay. And then from the middle out to the outside. Um, I'll let it dry a little while and then I'll go around it with the router to conform it to the size of the cabinet. Okay, the next step is to reinforce it with a few screws. Not really necessary, but... Then I measure where the slide has to come on the slide out and indicate the center line. And I'll indicate a few screw holes here. This is my toilet. I'm prepared to do some spraying.
I did remove the original hinges of the toilet seat because they extended a little bit too much. Uh, so I bought a couple of uh, regular hinges that I'm going to install now. Okay, so I've got three little pigs, uh, three little holes. So the location of the toilet seat is okay now. Now I'll just first indicate where the sides of the hinges. Okay, so now I got my hinge and I can place it fairly precisely. And I'll use my L to indicate where the screws are going to be. So and that's where I can put in the screws. For all kinds of reasons, mostly the minimalism I'm trying to apply uh, I'm forced to cut up some, at least a little part of the both sides of the uh, toilet seat. So that's what I'm going to do now. So. So I've got my slide out, this will have the uh, bucket and to prevent it from sliding I'll put in some clips or whatever you want to call it. Now I'll be cutting and uh, applying some formica uh, on the slide out of the toilet. Now we've got all the pieces for the slide out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pieces. Some more gluing. Cut some from my cut the glue. So I'll start with this. Okay, got some. Glue that's ready to go. Yeah. I'll let this dry a bit, and then the next piece is here on the side as well as this one. Hi guys, this is Joey and we're building a one-of-a-kind RV. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. If you enjoyed the video, give us a like and subscribe. Or better yet, uh, leave a comment. Thanks guys.
done a good job. <laughs>